கார்த்திகேயன் ஸோ என்ன மிஸ் கார்த்திகேயனா கார்த்திகேயன் No, sir. I, actually, the other guy asked. I just uh, messaged that. So. Okay, okay. So, it is a little bit difficult to uh, uh, see, the, see the message. So, it is better to tell directly. Okay. Thank you. Okay, sir. So, okay. Just I will again repeat the poem. Uh, if the center of curvature of the ellipse x square by a square plus y square by b square equal to 1, at one end of the minor axis uh, lies at the other end. prove that the eccentricity of the s is 1 by root 2 okay so in the question uh, what is given the question the center of curvature of ellipse at the point capital b lies at <coughs> b dash so that is given the question <coughs> and also we know that from the definition of uh, center of curvature uh the length b b dash is nothing but a row the length b b dash is a row but that is equal to 2b okay so now i am going to find y dash and y double dash from the equation x square by a square plus y square by b square equal to 1 so if you differentiate uh, this equation with respect to x you will get 2x 2x divided by a square plus 2y divided by b square Into y dash is equal to zero. So if you divide throughout by two, divide throughout by two, we have x square by a square plus uh, y into y dash by b square equal to zero. From this, we can find the first derivative y dash. So y y dash divided by b square equal to minus uh, x by a square. From this, y dash is equal to y dash is equal to Minus b square divided by a square into x divided by y. So I call this is equation number two. So now I am going to find y dash at the point capital B. Capital B is what zero comma b. So x is zero and the y is b. When when x is zero, so everything is zero. So y dash at the given point is zero. So next uh, we need to find y double dash. So the constant term is what. Minus b square by a square, minus b square by a square, and the u by v method. So x by y. So if you differentiate x by y, so you keep y. I uh, should uh, square the denominator, and you should keep the uh, denominator in the as it is y. If you differentiate x, so you'll get one minus x into. If you differentiate y, y dash. So now y double dash at the point is zero comma b. So x zero, y b. So this is constant. So y is b, okay. X is zero, and uh, again y is b, b square. So b square, b square gets cancelled. So minus b by a square. So y double dash at the given point is minus b by a square. Now we need to find the row. So row at the point is zero comma b equal to one plus y dash square. Y dash is what zero. Y dash square zero whole power three by two divided by y double dash y double dash is minus b by a square so I need a modulus of rho rho is always positive so and hence sir the modulus of rho equal to a square by b but we already know that uh, rho is uh, two uh, two b okay we already know that rho is equal to two b now I am going to equate two b Is equal to a square by b. So 2b equal to a square by b. So from this a square equal to 2b square. The eccentricity of the ellipse, uh, eccentricity e of the ellipse is given by b square equal to a square into 1 minus e square. Uh, from this uh, b square equal to just multiply a square minus a square e square. Now uh, just simplification. Uh, Or you can rewrite like this: a square e square is equal to a square minus b square. From this, e square equal to a square minus b square by a square. But we know that a square equal to two b square. So replace a square by two b square. So e square equal to two b square minus b square divided by again a square equal to two b square. The numerator is b square. The denominator is two b square. So b square b square gets cancelled. So e square equal to one by two, and e equal to one by root two. 
so this is the uh, answer for uh, this problem okay so can i go to the next problem yes sir okay thank you so so here find the center of uh, this is the last problem the center of curvature next is a section i'll go to evolute so find the center of curvature at theta equal to pi by 2 on the curve x is equal to 2 cos t uh, plus cos 2t and y equal to 2 sin t plus sin 2t so even you can try this problem just i will give the outline of this problem because th this is again a computation only uh, dx by dt equal to so you should differentiate this one if you, if you differentiate this you'll get what minus 2 sin t uh, if you differentiate cos 2t you'll get uh, uh, you'll get minus uh, sin uh, 2t into 2 similarly dy by dt dy by dt is uh, 2 cos t plus 2 cos 2t so next i need dy by dx so dy by dx is equal to dy by dt divided by dx by dt so from this take 2 commonly so you'll get this expression so 2 into cos t plus cos 2t from this i'll take minus 2 commonly so sin t plus sin 2t for the numerator i am going to apply cos c minus cos d formula so cos c plus cos d is 2 cos of c plus d by 2 cos of c minus d by 2 similarly for the denominator sin c plus sin d so that is equal to 2 sin c plus d by 2 sin c minus c minus d by 2 so the numerator you can write 2 cos of c plus d is what t plus 2t is 3t by 2 and the cos of t minus 2t so cos of minus t is again cos t so cos t by 2 divided by sin c plus sin d so 2 sin of c plus d t plus 2t is 3t divided by 2 and cos of c minus d so t minus 2t is uh, cos of minus t by 2 so again cos t by 2 so i think cos t by 2 cos t by 2 gets cancelled remaining you have 2 2 gets cancelled remaining you have minus cos 3 t by 2 divided by sin 3 t by 2 from this you'll get minus cot 3 t by 2 dy by dx so next you need to find second derivative second derivative d square y by dx square equal to d by dx of dy by dx and you can rewrite this is uh, d by dt of dy by dx is minus cot 3t by 2 into dt by dx so if you differentiate cot 3t by 2 you'll get minus cosecant square 3t by 2 into 3 by 2 and uh, dt by dx is just a reciprocal of dx by dt dx by dt so if a reciprocal of uh, dx by dt is what 1 by please check it minus 2 into sin t plus sin 2t and uh, minus 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 there are 3 minus so minus so 3 by 2 into 2 4 into cosecant square 3t by 2 and here again sin c plus sin d formula sin c plus sin d is 2 sin of c plus d by 2 so t plus 2t uh, 3t by 2 and the cos of c minus d by 2 so c minus d is uh, minus t minus t by 2 cos of minus x is cos x so next step minus 3 by 4 into 2 8 and i am writing everything in terms of sin and cos so you can write this is 1 by sin square 3t by 2 here already you have sin 3t by 2 so sin cube 3t by 2 into cos t by 2 okay so we got first derivative and the second derivative first derivative is what first derivative is uh, minus cot 3t by 2 so now i'm going to find the y dash at a t equal to pi by 2 so y dash is minus cot 3t by 2 uh, minus cot 3t by 2 so t equal to pi by 2 means 
minus cot 3 pi by 4, 3 pi by 4, which is equal to minus cot 3 pi by 4, you can write pi minus pi by 4, 4 pi minus pi is 3 pi by 4, and uh, this is in the second quadrant, pi minus means second quadrant, in the second quadrant, the value of cot is here, we have minus cot, okay, uh, it will not change, okay, so minus cot pi by 4, okay, and uh, minus into minus plus, so cot pi by 4, cot pi by 4 is the reciprocal of tan pi by 4, so tan pi by 4, you know that 1, so cot pi by 4 is also 1, so y dash at the given point is 1. So next we need to find y double dash. This is y double dash. Uh, we need to calculate at a t equal to pi by 2. So minus 3 by 8, 1 by sine q, 3 pi by 4 into cos pi by 4. Cos pi by 4, we know that 1 by root 2. The only thing we need to find sine q, 3 by, by 4. So Again, sine 3 by, by 4, you can write uh, it is a sine of uh, pi minus uh, pi by 4, that is 4 pi minus pi, again 3 pi by 4. So again, this, this is in the second quadrant, sine pi minus, the second quadrant sine is positive, so sine is positive and it, and, uh, and it will return as it is, so sine pi by 4, pi no, uh, sine of pi minus pi by 4 is sine pi by 4, sine pi by 4 is 1 by root 2, so and hence sine cube 3 by 3 pi by 4 is 1 by root 2 whole cube and the cos pi by 4 is 1 by root 2, so if you simplify you will get a minus 3 by 4, 3 by 8, uh, 1 by root 2 whole cube is uh, uh, 1 by 2 into 1 by root 2 into 1 by root 2. So this is 1 by 4, 1 by 1 by 4. The final answer is minus 3 by 2. So y double dash at the given point is minus 3 by 2. Similarly, you need to find you need to find the given point x at t equal to pi by 2 and y at t equal to pi by 2. So x is what? 2 cos t plus cos 2t. You can check it. So 2 cos t plus cos 2t and y equal to 2 sin t plus sin 2t. Substitute t equal to pi by 2. So x at the given point is minus 1, y at the given point is 2. Now we need to find x bar and y bar. So I think you can just read if you have any difficulties, you can ask me because it's just, uh, just it's a computation hereafter. The whole problem is a computation. but Somewhere else we are using the formula, so that's why I want to explain that one. And if you have any doubts in this problem, even you can ask me now, otherwise you can ask me later. Okay. So next section, I'm going to start uh, evolute. Okay. Uh, so before going to the proper definition, suppose uh, this is a given curve, this is the given curve, uh, this is the point P0, uh, C0 is the center of curvature of P0, C0 is the center of curvature of center of curvature for the point P0. Similarly, C1 is the center of curvature okay, for the point P1 and so on. Similarly, for the point P2, C2 is the center of curvature. Okay. C2 is the center of curvature. Okay. Now, uh, if you trace this curve like this, you'll, you'll also have a point C0, C1, C2 like this. Now, if you connect this center of curvature, you will get another curve. Okay. So, this curve is called uh, evolute of uh, this uh, given curve. So this is the uh, oral definition, okay? But uh, here the definition is given and the locus of the center of curvature for a curve is called the evolute of the curve. And the given curve is called the involute, 
the given curve itself is called a involute. I think uh, uh, day before yesterday, I sent a link. I think some of you also replied that uh, uh, I, I sent the uh, I sent the uh, uh, evolute of the ellipse. Okay, evolute of the ellipse. So, so in the animation, you can you can see. Suppose if you trace the ellipse, okay, the points will change here like this. Okay, it is. Okay, if you trace the points here, it, it is also changing po the points here. So this is the central curvature, actually for the corresponding the points on the ellipse. Similarly, you have so so looks like the asteroid, looks like the asteroid. Okay, so this is one of the example. Uh, that's why I send the link to you. Similarly, for tractor is also I send the link to you, but I can't find the remaining curves. For example, parabola, okay, and uh, hyperbola and rectangular hyperbola, cycloid. I got the cycloid, but I can't find the evolute of the cycloid. So please check the net because you should uh, at least you should know something visually, okay. So you know how to solve the problem, okay. But if you know visually uh, how the curves looks like, then uh, uh, that is a little bit uh, uh, maybe useful for you later. Okay, so this is the introduction to uh, evolute. Now uh, I am going to solve the problem. So, uh, first, uh, first problem is find the evolute of the parabola y square equal to 4x. So before this, before this, so just I will give the steps to be followed here. The first step you should write the parametric form of the given curve so that is the first step second step you should find dx by dt or dx by d theta whatever it may be and then dy by dt and then third step you should find uh, first derivative that is dy by dx and the fourth step you should find the second derivative d square y by dx square and then fifth step should find x bar okay and sixth step you should find y bar that is center of curvature so up to this everything is same up to six steps you know how to do it only the seventh step is new for you okay so that's why I gave so many problems in central curvature because that is a basic. That is a basic you should know. So now you should eliminate. Eliminate. T or theta, whatever it may be the parameter. Eliminate the parameter. Eliminate the. Eliminate the parameter. t from x bar and y bar x bar and y bar x bar and y bar by using by using the known identities known known identities okay so you should eliminate t okay the parameter t so this is the procedure so if you know this procedure you can solve any problem in evolute okay first problem find the evolute of the parabola Find the evolute of the parabola 
uh, y square equal to 4ax. Okay, usually in the classroom, uh, I will ask somebody, okay, just uh, I will ask some questions. I think uh, I'm going to split uh, the whole problem into how many steps? How many steps? Seven steps. Uh. So for the first step and second step, somebody will answer. Up to third step also, because up to dy by dx, you can do it. Okay, who is ready? For the what is the first step? Otherwise, I will. Ramakrishna left the meeting. Why, ba? So due to, can you hear my voice now or not? Yes, sir. OK. Yes, sir. So OK, at least anybody respond, please. Uh, otherwise, I am speaking the, the whole owner means it is a little bit boring for you. So that's why I'm asking uh, you should uh, respond something. So what is the parametric form? Uh, uh, pa anyone, a anyone. X is equal to a t square and uh, y equal to 2 a t r. So, uh, so per, this is a parametric equation. Parametric, you should write here. Parametric equations are x is equal to a t square and y equal to 2 a t. Okay, what is the dx by dt? But this is a simple question only. But if you contribute here, okay, then it is a little bit of interaction you have. Okay, that's why I'm asking. Dx by dt is what? 2? Two? 280. 280 dy by dt is equal two. to 2 a. Okay. What is a dy by dx? 1 by t. 1 by, One by t. Okay. So 2a by 280, 1 by t. Okay. So okay, I think up to this, uh, uh, so remaining part, uh, next student, d square, at least for second derivative, somebody will come and tell how to write. Step by step, don't tell that the last step. Okay, usually how we will calculate, because you know how to do up to x bar and y bar. You know the, the, the procedure, everything. So first step, you should d square by dx square equal to how to write. D of dy by dx. Ah, d, by, d by dx of dy by dx are correct. By by. Okay, I think we will write like this. Okay. So next step, d by dx or d by this is actually a function D. of t, d by dt, okay, of dy by dt is what? 1 by t into by dt t. by dx. Into dt by dx. Okay. So now, uh, d by dt of 1 by t is minus 1 by t square, D. okay. Uh, what is dt by dx? Reciprocal of dx by dt, that is into 1 by 2. Uh, 280. 280. 280. 280. So this implies a uh, second derivative d square y by dx square equal to minus 1 by 280. Okay, up to this uh, uh, second part is over. So next, uh, next one, who is ready to? Uh, explain how, how to calculate x bar. First, tell what is the x bar formula. Uh, x minus x minus y dash by y double uh, dash y dash y dash, uh, yeah, dash by okay y dash into one plus y dash y, square 
sorry, sorry, sorry. Minus 12. Uh, y dash square divided by y double dash. Y by dash. Okay. That is now, uh, uh, 80 square. 80 square. Minus 1 uh, by t. 1 by t. Uh, into 1, uh, 1 plus uh, 1 by uh, t square. Okay. Uh, whole divided by. Uh, whole, uh, not whole minus, divided by. Not by whole. Uh, yeah. Okay. Uh, Minus one by uh, two eighty uh, cube. Okay. So okay. Uh, and then remaining part we need to simplify simplification. Okay. Uh, okay. If you know, you can tell. Otherwise, I will do it. You will tell, or otherwise, I will do it. You will tell your. Okay, sir. Okay. Uh, Eighty uh. square. Okay, plus. Min yeah, minus into minus plus, minus into minus plus. So 1 by t, first you should write 1 by t, and then uh, the reciprocal of 1 by 280 cube is 280 cube. Okay, because we need to write at least uh, this step, okay, into 1 plus 1 by t square. Okay, now I think now you wrote, uh, usually the students will write. The, the don't write this term because they know that this is 280 square but from my point of view i need to write this term maybe some other students don't know that's why i will write this term okay now you'll tell 80 square plus uh 280 square uh, 280 square uh minus 380 square plus 2a uh, 280 square is okay. Uh, no, okay. no. Uh. 80 square plus 280 square plus 2 here. Yeah. Uh, uh, okay. Now, 80 square multiply plus 280 square. square plus t square t plus square gets cancelled. Two. Yes. Yeah, so, so now, what is so x bar? Finally, we will get 380 square plus 2 here. So x bar equal to 3a. T square, 380 square plus 2A. Okay. Plus 2A. Okay, thank you. What is your name? Uh, Kirtana, sir. Kirtana, okay. So, so I think uh, you are explaining slowly, okay? I am expecting the same thing from the remaining uh, students. So, don't be rushed, rush, because you may feel a little bit, uh, uh, sometimes you may feel uh because this is new for you maybe so even it may be wrong i don't tell anything so i will correct you okay so be cool and uh, uh, you know what you, you can tell whatever you know i will correct you okay so next uh, y bar so who is willing to tell the steps or y bar First step formula. Y plus. Oh, Pragadisha. Okay. Yes, sir. Y plus. One plus y dash square. One plus y dash square divided by. Y double dash. Y double dash. Okay. So this is equal to y. What is y? Two eighty. Uh, 1 plus ah, 1 plus 1 by t square 1 by t square Div divided by minus ah, because one y by dash is y dash is 1 by t so 1 by t square okay y double dash is uh, minus 1 by 2 by t cube okay so now if you simplify this first step you should write 2 a t so plus minus minus ah. minus 2 a t cube uh, 280 cube into t square plus 1 oh, yeah, divided one. by t square. Ah, you can take LCM also. Okay. You can take uh, LCM. Okay. t square plus 1 by t square. t square. Okay. Correct? Yes, sir. Okay. 
280. So t square t square. So remaining you have minus 2e t into t square plus 1. Next step plus 1. Okay, what? minus yes, 2e t into t square plus 1. Okay. 280, 280, uh, minus 280Q. Okay. Minus 280. Okay. So you can cancel these two. Uh. So Y bar equal yes, to minus 280Q. Minus 280Q. Okay. Very good. So, so next step, I am going to write X bar and Y bar in the next slide. So X bar equal to uh, 3A T square. Plus 2a and y bar equal to y bar equal to minus 2a t q so up to this uh, we got this we know how to proceed okay so we got the center of curvature the, the next step the last step is we need to eliminate the parameter t so uh, you should anybody should tell the idea only the remaining part i will do it so the calculation part i will simplify and uh, and I, I will do it so if you know how to do it you can explain slowly how to so, do it. Uh, yeah from the first one you can write uh, t squared equals to uh, ah. x bar minus 2a uh, divided by 3a sir Okay. And so, uh, the second one we can write t cube is equals to y bar by minus 2a. Okay. Uh, and then squaring the t cube uh, term that is on both sides, we have to square it. And okay. uh, uh, to the power 3 on the t squared terms and then okay. equating those two. Yes, correct. So your idea is correct. Okay, thank you. And so I will do the same thing I'm going to do now. So from this equation, I'm going to find a t square. So t square equal to t square equal to x bar minus 2a divided by 3a from this. So from this, uh, I'm going to write t cube is minus y bar divided by 2a. So here I have t square, here I have t cube. So, so I, I want, I'm going to take cube on both sides here. Then here I'll get t power 6 and taking square on both sides. Then I'll get t power 6 here. So from taking cube on both sides, so t power 6 is equal to x bar minus 2a divided by 3a whole cube. So here t power 6 squaring on both sides y bar by 2a and whole power uh, square so the left hand side is the same then you can equate the right hand side so from this we have x bar minus 2a divided by uh, you can write whole q this is a 27 27 aq so minus y bar square is y bar square divided by 4 a square so you can cancel here a square here have a q so then a power 1 so 4 a square 4 a square uh, into x bar minus 2a whole cube equal to 27 27 a into y bar square so this is a uh, but we need the we need to find the locus of x bar and y bar so locus of x bar comma y bar is 4 into x minus 2a whole cube is equal to 27 a y square 
uh, which is the evolute of the parabola. is the value of the parabola y square equal to 48 okay so next problem is a practice problem for you or note down practice problem find the evolute of the parabola Y square, sorry, x square equal to 4 a y x square equal to 4 a y so already i gave this problem to find the center of curvature center of curvature okay so so suppose if you solve that problem only thing you need to eliminate the parameter t okay so what is the parametric form of uh, parametric form of uh, x square equal to 4 a y Anybody? X is equal to 280 and y equal to 80 square. Uh, so the final answer also, you need to change uh, uh, instead of x, y. Okay, so please check it. So 4 into y minus 2a whole cube equal to 27 a x square so this is the final answer okay now the next problem is uh, find the evolute of the ellipse Find the evolute of the ellipse uh, x square by a square plus y square by b square equal to 1. Okay, solution. Okay, now. So what is the parametric form of the ellipse? Yeah. X is equal to A cos theta and Y equal to B sin theta. Okay. It's a parametric equations. X is equal to A cos theta and y equal to b sin theta okay now we should we need to differentiate so dx by d theta so what is dx by d theta minus a sin theta and dy by d theta equal to b cos theta and dy by dx equal to minus b by a cos theta by sin theta okay it is cot theta it is cot theta so dy by dx is equal to minus b by a cot theta next you need to find the second derivative d square y by dx square So d by dx of dy by dx. So in the next step, so that is equal to d by d d, uh, d by d theta of dy by dx is minus b by a 
cot theta into d theta by dx. So if you differentiate uh, the minus b by a, I will take it out, constant. If you differentiate cot theta, you will get the minus cosecant square theta. And the reciprocal of d theta by dx, uh, sorry, uh, d theta by dx is the reciprocal of dx by d theta, that is 1 by minus a sin theta. So please check. Okay, so you have 3 minus, so again you have minus b by a square minus b by a square. Uh, now I am going to write everything in terms of sin. So 1 by uh, sin cube theta. So this is uh, second derivative d square by dx square. Okay. So next uh, x bar. So who is ready to explain x bar? Uh, okay. Yes. Yeah, please tell. Uh, X bar equal to, uh, yeah. Your voice is not audible and also uh, it's not clear from your uh, side. Sir. Is it clear now? Uh, now clear. Okay. Yeah. Uh, X bar is equal to uh, hmm. X dash. Oh, X minus Y dash. Q1 plus Y dash square. 1 plus Y dash square. By Y double dash. Yeah, okay. Y double dash. Okay. And then what is x? Uh, a cos theta. A cos theta. Uh, uh, a minus? Minus, uh, minus b by a cot theta. Into. Minus b by a cot theta. Okay. Uh, into a square by b square plus x square theta. Uh, one, one more minute. First, we'll write. Uh, 1 plus uh, y dash square, okay, and then I will write next step. Yes. One, okay, 1 plus uh, y dash square is uh, b square by a square into cot square theta. Whole divided by, uh, not whole divided by, only for this part. Okay, that is equal to y double dash. Y double dash is uh, minus b by a, sorry, b by a square into 1 by sine cube theta. Is it correct? Yes, sir. Okay. Next step. So that is equal to a cos cube theta. A cos theta. Okay. And then what is the next step? Okay. So usually I will do it. First, I will simplify this part. Okay. And then I'm going to either I'll take LCM or you can directly multiply. So that is my usual, usually I will do it because before simplifying this, I don't multiply by here. Okay. So it is better to first simplify this part. And then if you want to take LCM, okay, you can take LCM. Otherwise you can directly multiply. So how you done it? Directly. Same, 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 uh, okay. So, same, okay. Then, uh, then minus, minus, minus. So, minus, okay, minus, uh, please tell. Uh, actually, uh, sine theta is cosine square theta. Okay, okay, otherwise, I will write, please check it, okay, because. Uh, 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 because I am writing step by step, maybe you wrote uh, your simplification is a uh, little bit uh, sh sh the shorter form. So okay, please check your answer. I am I am doing little bit by step by step method. Okay, because uh, every should every student should understand the procedure. That's why okay, please check it. So minus uh, minus 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 minus. So minus b by a. You can write cot theta by cos theta by sin theta. Okay, minus b by a. Minus b by a. You can write cot theta is cos theta.
cos theta divided by sin theta and then uh, this uh, sin q theta is going to the numerator so into sin q theta so into 1 plus uh, uh, a square by so you can even you can take uh, lcm okay so if you take lcm a square plus b square by uh, b square plus square theta divided by a square so a square okay sorry so here how cot square theta cot square theta means you should write in terms of uh, uh, cos square theta divided by sin square theta so one plus one plus b square by a square into cos square theta divided by sin square theta and this is equal to a cos theta minus uh, b by a if you simplify this you'll get sin square theta into sin square theta into cos theta into 1 plus or you can take lcm a square sin square theta plus b square cos square theta divided by k square sin square theta so sin square theta sin square theta gets cancelled so we'll get a cos theta minus multiply now if you multiply so if you multiply now we'll get the minus b by a cos theta into cos square theta into uh, 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 sin square theta okay so you'll get a gets cancelled a square a square gets cancelled so minus b by a minus b by a sin square theta into cos theta and if you multiply these two you have minus uh, b by a so minus b cube minus b cube into cos cube theta divided by a cube is it correct So a cos theta minus uh, here have b square okay I don't know where I did the mistake okay this is equal to a cos theta minus uh, b by a okay b by a cos theta by 
Please, okay, I'll check it here. Sir, it is just minus a sine squared cos theta, sir. Okay, so actually here minus 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 so minus so b b gets cancelled so minus a wa minus a sine cube theta. Okay, I think here I have done the mistake. So, so please check it here. It is minus a sine cube theta into cos theta by sin theta. So you can check it. So B, B gets cancelled. So A square by A is what? A, the numerator we have A, and in the numerator we have sin cube theta uh, into cos theta by sin theta. Cos theta by sin theta, I am writing here. So into 1 plus uh, B square by a square, cot square theta is cos square theta divided by sin square theta. So please check it. Now this is equal to a cos theta minus, uh, you can cancel this. So a sin square theta into cos theta. So into 1 plus b square by a square into cos square theta divided by sin square theta. So now throw out multiply by this, so you'll get a cos theta minus a sin square theta into cos theta. If you multiply these two, you'll get uh, sin square theta, sin square theta gets cancelled. One a is gets cancelled, so minus b square by a into sin theta into cos cube theta. Oh, sorry, sin square, sin square theta gets cancelled, only you have cos cube theta cos cube theta. So from this, I'm taking commonly a cos theta. So remaining is 1 minus sin square theta. 1 minus sin square theta is cos square theta. So minus b square by a into cos cube theta. So this is equal to uh, cos square theta, so a cos theta into cos theta is a cos cube theta minus b square by a into cos cube theta. So take a is LCM, so we will get a square cos cube theta uh, and also you can take a cube is also common, okay, okay, a square cos cube theta, so a square minus b square by a into cos cube theta. So first step you should take A is LCM and then you should take cos cube theta commonly. So this is your X bar. What is time now? I think 9.45 exactly. Okay, now I'll stop here. So remaining thing you need to find what? You need to find Y bar. Okay, the next class we will find y bar and then we need to eliminate uh, the parameter theta from x bar and y bar okay so okay thank you thank you sir. thank you thank you sir thank you thank you thank you thank you
இது போடுது மேடம் தேர்ட் ஒரு கிளாஸா இன்னைக்கு தேர்ட் ஒரு அங்கே ஒன்றும் பிரச்சனை இல்லை 